Hey guys, good morning. We are on the second to last day of the cruise. Uh, well, of what we're scheduled to be. I don't know. We may end up being out here a little bit longer because of the weather. We'll see on that. We're just kind of waiting around. We all had a lazy morning. Today is a day at sea. And so we've just been chilling. We all slept in late. We're meeting for brunch at 11. And we got our bathing suits on. I'm finally wearing this dress. <laughs> I didn't, I really, I had plans for it to wear it to Elegant Night and that didn't happen. So I was like, I bought this specifically for the cruise. So I'm going to wear it. Some of the other dresses and stuff that I have, I can wear when I'm home, but this is super tropical and we're headed into fall when we get home. I won't wear this at home. So <laughs> I knew I needed to wear it. I think this is the only outfit that I have left that I bought specifically for the cruise. I brought some things that I bought recently, but not specifically tropical cruise wear and stuff like that. So yeah, we're just kind of waiting around I'm tired today. I didn't do anything with my hair. Just put it up in a ponytail. We're about to go. Packing the crap out of me. Yeah. Have you already texted your brother? Yeah, we're meeting at 11. Oh, okay. Because, uh, what time is it? Because I didn't charge my phone. 10.30. Oh, you didn't? No. You, open you know, it seems Show like on the cruise, it goes by my what time no oh, the, the the charge yeah i wonder why i haven't been she's eating your glasses mom we're all in the room waiting for chubby and melissa they slept even later oh my god we're slap happy slap happy oh my gosh everyone slept with grandma last night so grandma's not <laughs> See grandma's eyes, they're bloodshot. <laughs> What's bloodshot mean, grandma? It means I didn't get any sleep. That's what it means. <laughs> and they think that's funny. So we we're at brunch, and I'm just like looking at my face thinking, today would have been a good day for some concealer, but that's okay. That's okay. Today's gonna be a fun day. We are having brunch in the Washington dining room where we have dinner. We've had breakfast here before. It's really nice. It's a sit down area. We're at a round table. We're waiting on um, Chibi, Melissa, and Logan. I brought Anderson with me. And we all have a place. This is the brunch that they have. So pretty cool. I got some coffee and water. <laughs> there they are. <laughs> judging me. Do you eat ketchup with your eggs? I like ketchup, but not on these times. I got potatoes. Huh? Oh, your fries? No, those are hot to make up. They're potatoes, right? Yeah, fries? Yeah, fries? Yeah, fries? Yeah, fries? Yeah, fries? Yeah, fries? What'd you get, Maddie? Did you like your food? Are you saving it for later? In the ears, on the eyelid, all in the hair. <laughs> was it that good? Breakfast was so good. Brunch was so good. It's 12.09. We're on the Lido deck where it's happening. There's so many people out here. And it's actually really sunny. But the boat is like rocking back and forth, back and forth. So I'm you like, can't do it yet. You have to wait, back to and forth. You have to but get. it's pretty outside. Three gold right now. Sun. How hot the last here. thing I need.
find swimming until we all started to get nauseous. Moms, no thank you. Mom's been nauseous since this morning and should be Melissa were nauseous at breakfast, at brunch. I was fine. And the rest is all fine. He, he doesn't have a weak stomach at all. It's like iron <laughs> steel in there, I swear. But I started, we were swimming, went on the slide, that was fun. We were swimming, the pool was fun. It wasn't that crowded and I started getting nauseous in the pool so I got out and now I can't shake it so I had to take a Dramamine and I haven't had to, I don't even know that I needed a Dramamine the very first day but I haven't taken one since the first day and today is super choppy oh my gosh it's awful 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 so we are in the Ivanhoe theater about to play bingo or in a little while might as well keep playing bingo right <laughs> nothing else to do right now and the kids are in the kids club Everyone else is kind of spread out, getting stuff from around the ship. We are actually staying on the ship an extra day, which is crazy. We are porting in New Orleans tomorrow afternoon. We are supposed to be back in Galveston tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. And instead we are porting. So the captain announced that we are porting in New Orleans tomorrow at 4 p.m. We are supposed to be back in Galveston tomorrow 8 a.m. So Saturday the 26th at 8 a.m. So now we are porting in New Orleans Saturday the 26th at 4 p.m. And we are staying there until Galveston's port opens. However, they sent out multiple warnings that all of the vehicles at the port of Galveston will probably be totaled because they're expecting 24 inches of rain, which means all of the vehicles will flood. Which is insane to me. We put, we parked our the pilot in, like I showed you guys, in an indoor facility, um, but that doesn't mean that it won't still flood. So this trip has been awesome. Uh, it's kind of ending on a crazy note. The very first day that we got here, we had a solar eclipse, and the last day that we're ending, we're having a hurricane. Uh, yeah, I mean, very very nice first cruise impression, I'd say. So we are for sure adding one extra day to our trip, possibly two, which is a little nerve wracking just because Emmy has school on Monday and I can't even talk to her school until Monday morning. So that's nerve wracking. Um, Andres has to call work. I don't work, I'm not scheduled to work till Wednesday, so that's not a huge deal. And pretty much just Bia and Nin are taking care of the dogs, which is worries me also. We're supposed to have a lot of rain in San Antonio as well. So it's just kind of crazy. So we're just trying to like do things to stay calm and just on, baby, the captain okay. has assured us that we're not going anywhere near the storm. We're perfectly safe and we're not worried about that. It's more worried about everything back home, which is, it's just crazy to me that this is happening on our first cruise. <laughs> and that we're extending our first cruise from five days to seven. What are you gonna do? We just got to playing bingo. None of us won, we got super close. I was only one number away from winning the jackpot, which was 500 bucks. You had two numbers? It was, we were really close. Two people ended up winning it though, so. Yeah, the prize was supposed to be $5,000. They ended up, it ended up being 500, but still, I would've taken it. Hey, not greedy, I'll take any amount of money when it's free money, you know. Plus I won $5 on the little pull tap thing. That was cool. So now we're going to get, it's so funny, if you watch my brother's vlogs, it's just gonna, we're gonna be bouncing back and forth off of each other. Every time somebody says something, it's just gonna be one or the other. Oh, I wanna focus. Take that style off. <laughs> <laughs> so we're headed to get the kids a little snack. Dinner's in about an hour and 45 minutes. Mom went to go take a nap because apparently we wore her out today. Ooh, look at that sun. Today we got, I'm not sure what, <laughs> the rest of the Loch Ness, Mon not Loch Ness Monster, maybe a lizard, or giraffe, maybe a giraffe, what or it, what, can I, can I take a dinosaur, maybe it's a dinosaur. Okay. We also got our stuff to get off the ship, however we're not getting off the ship tomorrow, so not sure what's going on there. And don't lose my shoes. If you lose it, you owe me two dollar plus tax. Don't lose. Okay. 
Any idea? I don't know. Let me check. Let me check. Let me check. I'm here, right? Oh my God! <laughs> Hold the bill Hold the bill Blow. Can you just blow for her? Blow. 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 Very good. Oh. Now he's not happy, he lost five dollars. He lost five dollars. I know. I know where that one is. He's sitting here. I know. You didn't feel that? <laughs> Let me check, is it real or fake? Can you see the coin trick that goes in your ear? Like Tony did? Can you tip me fake or <laughs> Can you imagine the coin trick that For me? Yeah. Why is it gone? Why is it Give me your plate. I mean. We're trying to accumulate all the shot glasses. Was it good? <laughs> How many nights is this for steak, baby? Did everybody enjoy your dinner? If you want some five nights, let me know, okay? Chip, Autumn, was that delicious? Was that good? I said, this is all we can eat. All we can eat, mom. So I just stuff everything in my face. Huh. Oh, that is a cute cake. You got the cherry pie? Mm -hmm. I love my Taste, nature points the way. Nothing left to say. We're currently watching Beauty and the Beast on the deck. Right above Lido, having some popcorn, waiting to go to the comedy show. I am so dumb. I just sat here and talked to the camera for five minutes. Wasn't even recording. Oh, so crazy. So like I was saying, uh, I'm out here looking at the boats that are close to us. I guess we're all here waiting for the storm to pass. I saw on Facebook, I do have access to the internet. They released, Carnival released the phone lines and the internet for free to everyone so that I guess we could get in touch with loved ones and whatnot. And even, I guess there's so many people on the ship using it or just in general that we don't have enough internet. So because of that, it's going so slow. I can see your messages on Snapchat and Instagram. I can see them coming in but I cannot respond. It like literally will not let me respond to them. So I wish I could update you guys and let you know that we are safe right now. As of right now, the only thing we know is that we're porting in New Orleans tomorrow to refuel and get things going. And then we're supposed to be waiting for the Galveston port to open back up because right now it's completely closed. They are giving everyone the option to get off in New Orleans if they want to like do their own accommodations to get home. We're not going to do that. There's way too many of us to try and find flights and stuff to get back home. Plus our cars are in Galveston. And uh, to my knowledge, Galveston has already been hit pretty bad. And our cars may not even 
be good. So what a way to do your first cruise, right? Man, it's crazy, crazy. So right now I'm just trying to kind of chill, relax. We're watching movies out on the deck and I'm watching all the big boats around us. You can see that one is probably the closest. There's a whole bunch of them out there. There's a few on the other side too, um, but that one's the closest. And, and I don't know how, how far away it is, but it's pretty close. And it actually was a little closer not that long ago. So we're all kind of, there's another one out there. We're all kind of in the same boat, no pun intended. <laughs> Just kind of waiting around for further instructions. We're all bobbing in the Gulf Coast. I saw on Facebook one thing that popped up. Somebody sent me a picture saying that 20,000 cruise passengers are stuck at sea right now. So, yeah, there's that. So today is technically supposed to be the last day of our trip. It's about 11.25 p.m. We were supposed to dock in Galveston at 8 a.m. and get off. We're in New Orleans. So we are, I guess, I don't know if the pools and stuff are gonna be closed. I don't really know what's going on. So we're just kind of waiting around to hear something. We're going to breakfast, which shouldn't have happened this morning. That was something that was not supposed to go on. Uh, we do have some sort of service, so our Carnival Hub app does not work, which means I can't get in touch with my brother and Melissa. So, ooh, I almost fell. So, um, yeah, we're just not even sure what's going on. We're gonna try and go with flow, see what happens. We will be uh, getting up to the port of New Orleans at about one o'clock. Uh, as we shared yesterday, folks, we will be loading provisions, and once we complete our loading this afternoon, the ship will start making its way back to Galveston to be in position to dock once the port does reopen. At the time right now, the port of Galveston does and still remain closed, and we continue to monitor the storm closely, and uh, we, were, we are staying in touch with the port officials. We'll provide you with any updates as soon as we have more information on when the port does reopen. In the meantime, our thoughts and prayers are, of course, with the communities affected by Hurricane Harvey. Now, because we, we have returned into the U.S., uh, we're returning to our first port back into the U.S. Uh, from being outside. Customs and border protection laws require that all guests complete an immigration process. And this happens anytime you leave the U.S. coming back into the United States. Some guests have decided to uh, end their cruise today in New Orleans, and we wish you a safe journey home. These guests will disembark the ship first once we do port into, uh, into New Orleans and we do get the ship's clearance. So all the guests that are leaving the ship today and not returning back will be the first ones to leave with all of their luggage in hand. And of course, we'll be cleared by CBP ashore in the terminal. If you are leaving today, please make sure you receive the uh, make sure you head on down to so you guys know just about as much as we know right now. Again, we can actually get off the boat in New Orleans. I have no idea if we're going to or not, but we're only gonna be here like four or five hours. So I don't know. This is crazy. Seriously, like I cannot believe this is our first cruise. We would have this experience, I feel like. Crazy. Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Wait, here. Okay, we are currently in the customs line to get off of the ship. We are going to get out in New Orleans for a little while just because autumn is pretty much out of formula. We have some, we have baby water still. Half a gallon of baby water and we're running low on diapers. So that was the one problem that we had uh, or else we weren't going to get off the ship because this line is super long. You have to go through customs, it's a big old hassle. But we are because I'm hoping somewhere in this mall they have formula at least. I mean, we were going to cut off Autumn and switch her to milk later this week anyway, but she just, to cut her off cold turkey, I don't want to give her diarrhea or anything. So, anyway, we are currently in line waiting. It's a madhouse right now. The children are crazy. They have been all day. And honestly, as fun as this trip has been, I can't wait to get home. So we just had our first Uber experience. Never been on an Uber before. 
Latoya, you were so sweet, thank you. Um, that was pretty good. Had to strap in all the kiddos. We're at Walmart. <laughs> There's a Walmart everywhere and we find ourselves at it. Hello, New Orleans. <laughs> we are at the Walmart on, which, which street are we on? Which street are we on? This is uh, Chapatulas. Chapatulas? Chapatulas. Chapatulas. <laughs> Thank you. That's the Walmart that we're at. I told you guys we need formula, wipes, diapers for autumn. Baby pa baby food too, because no telling how much longer we're going to be on the ship, which is super disappointing. <laughs> I, was, I prepared so nicely for all of this, and um, it just didn't work out the way it's supposed to. But that's okay. We're going to make it work. Make the most of the rest of this vacation. Autumn is totally oblivious. Autumn! Autumn. Who do happy? She's like Walmart this is my happy place. Okay, now this may be like someone saying they expect people to be on horses and holding shotguns in Texas. But this is exactly how I envisioned New Orleans. Exactly. And I realize not the whole city is like this, but this is so cool! Free vacation in New Orleans, baby! <laughs> From Mardi Gras, all the beads in it. That is so cool. They just must leave them there. Autumn! Autumn! Hey, over here. Cheese. Don't touch him, don't touch him. Don't touch him. Good, Maddie? Two 
thumbs up? <laughs> they sell these hats here. I had to poke a hole for the bun. But I got it on. 15 cents. Pretty good deal. Had to make room for the fun buns too. Look how pretty this charger is. It's like a chameleon pink orange. That's my next car. Color, not car, color. And there's our ship. We're waiting to get back on. And this big old long line. No joke. Day one, all over again. This anyway. I gotta put my face over there, and I'm gonna smell like nasty Cheetos. Gross. I don't want your nasty Cheeto feet on my pillow. Tell him, don't do that to Grandma. Don't do that to Grandma. Tell her she's on your pillow. I don't get it. Look, now she can stand up from, look, watch her, watch, watch, watch. Okay, now she's got her butt on me, but, but she was, she, she makes the effort here without holding on yeah. to anything. She does too, she can stand on her own, she just doesn't, if she's already standing, she can stand on her own. Like standing up from a squatting position, she doesn't Daddy. do. 